Hey everybody, Lon Seidman back again. This time we're taking a look at the Amigo Cobra microphone. It, uh, on the surface, looks like any other cheapo USB mic you might pick up, and the uh, packaging makes some very bold claims about how it can filter out piercing noises and all this other stuff. And I have to admit, uh, I was very, very skeptical, but as you'll see in these two audio samples that I'm going to put up in a second, uh, it actually does work as advertised. Let's just take a quick look, though, at the product itself. Uh, it is made of relatively, uh, you know, it feels a little, little cheap in its construction, but it doesn't feel any different than other USB mics. Uh, you can move the uh, microphone up and down with one of these uh, little stand, uh, arms here on a wire, and it has a pretty generous USB cable, so you can move it uh, fairly far away from your computer. Uh, the one thing that I did find with it is that you really need to hold it up close because uh, it doesn't really pick up your voice uh, if it's just sitting on the desk like this. And I think what they've done is they've mixed a little bit of a cardioid microphone uh, along with some uh, noise canceling technologies to really uh, get rid of uh, any excess noise and only pull out the voice. So let's take a look at the microphone in action and how it did with some really noisy conditions. Okay, we're here with the Amigo on my desk here, and we're going to try something first. Uh, we're going to load up some music from the free, not music, some sound effects from the free sound project. And we have a Boeing 777 interior jet sound, so we're going to hit play. And you can hear how loud that is on camera. Uh, but when I switch to the Amigo, you don't hear it at all, and it's remarkable. And in fact, if I turn my chair around and have the sound behind me, you still can't hear it. It's pretty remarkable. Um, now, if we switch to uh, another sound like music, uh, we're going to give that a shot now and see if uh, something that's not white noise will make it any different. Okay, so now we are going to load up some music here. Now, the music is playing, and I am talking into the Amigo. And as you can hear, you can't hear the music much at all, even though it's a varying pattern. So pretty remarkable. This stuff is blasting right now, and the microphone is able to discern my voice over the music. So that's the Amigo Cobra, uh, quite an impressive microphone for uh, what it looks like and costs like. Uh, you're not going to be able to do your podcast with this, as you saw. I mean, certainly the audio quality is decent, but it's not uh, up to broadcast spec, but it's really designed for voice over IP applications or voice recognition. And those are the two things that really need a, a pretty clear sample of the voice. And this is, works great for that. So if you're doing Skype calls or you have you know, a noisy environment that you need to communicate with people in, uh, this thing may actually foot the bill. And uh, it, it's just pretty impressive all the way around. This is Lon Seidman. Thanks for watching.